stable series, then make sure to stick around and keep watching this week's video. So now as you can see here, I'm sanding down everything. That's why I've got my earmuffs on and as you can see, this is the sander right here. That's what I've done so far. And this one over here that I've already done took an hour and a half, but I'm very happy with how it turned out. I'll show you all like a couple clips in sequence of me sanding them down so I don't have to keep picking up the camera. I'm not sure how well you can see me, but now I'm gonna use this clear wood varnish on top of the wood on these. I sanded them as well as I could. It took me like an hour and a half each. They're not perfect, but they'll do for the shed. And I'll put that all in a little time lapse. Now I'm gonna take off all the knobs on the dresser with the screwdriver. seen in the past few clips I have what's it called primed or whatever you call it all the wood before I paint it so that the color doesn't seep through the paint so I've got this painting kit thing from Bunnings which let me see if I can get it open here so we just got the cheapest one we could find <laughs> It's a little bit small roller, but um, that was so that we can get in all the drawers and stuff. And I've also got this, and I'll get my screwdriver to get it open. So this, I'm not sure if you can see me or not, because I don't really want to put it on that. But this is our light grey paint. So let me angle you guys below to the ground so that you can see me open it. 
I'm not sure if you can exactly see me fully, but I'm just opening the paint. Which I probably should do it on something. So I went with a light gray so that it's like bright, but I didn't want to go white as I don't want to bring in too much white. And as you can see, that's sort of the lid. So it's just a little bit darker. And um, I was going to do a light pink and I just spilled that there, do not tell mum. Anyway, I was going to do a light pink, but then mum said I needed to be a bit more grown up. So that's why I have gone with a light gray. So I'm just checking this isn't gonna put anything in there, but I think we'll be good. So I'll just stir it. And I'll put it on the roller so I don't waste any. Perfect, okay. So as you can see, it's a really pretty light gray and I spilled it compared to um, the primer that is white. So let's put it on this, if I know how to. That's a good question. I don't even know if I'm doing it right, but we'll see. And I got it on me. How lovely. As you can see, I'm very good with paint. No. Okay, there we go. That roll is on. And let me go rinse this hand off. Quick. Okay, that's a little better. I'm not going to get paint everywhere. And also, my outfit, this is just old clothes. So, yeah, these pants keep falling down, but old t-shirt so yep now I'm going to pour some of this in my caddy pan thingy it's really pretty I'm in love with the color I was almost feeling like it was a little too light but now against the white I think I've definitely made the right decision so I'll just put that here with that on for now. That's not a smart idea. Okay. Anyway. So let me get a paintbrush because I'm sure I'll need one as well as the roller. Okay, so now I'll put you guys on an angle here and I'll speak through it and then after that I will put you all on a time lapse. So I don't know if I mentioned before or not as I do not have a good memory but I'm absolutely just wait I'm trying to get um, a leaf out I know off to a great start sorry about that okay I'm already in love with the finish on these tops so what I did was I sanded them and it took forever and then I put a varnish on which you will have seen a couple clips earlier and I was going to do this to the whole thing but um, I do not have the patience to sand it but it may have been quicker because painting this all is taking forever. Anyway, let's start. So I'm going to roll some of this onto my roller which I'm not very good at. Okay, I will not be a painter when I'm older. Anyway, um, okay, let's start on this one. Oh, I love that color. That's amazing. Yep, okay. I'm already in love with this color. And we weren't sure if we were going to prime or not, as it would cost, if the primer cost a lot, but. I'm glad we did it because I didn't want the stain coming through from this previously as I did not sand it all because I was too lazy to. So I'll just keep on painting and rolling all of this and here yeah, I'll just show you. So this is sort of the difference. So obviously this is not really as you would have a white but that's the grey I got and then this is the white and 
the grey colour, if you all would like to replicate it, I will tell you all at the very end with what I have used. Now enjoy the time lapse of me painting my chest of drawers. Better. But now I'm going to 
I'm going to put sawdust in Rainer's stable and I'll show you all that when it's done. Can ran out of this one, but it looks 
fine for now. So I'm gonna let them all dry and then we'll see what we do from there. Thanks everyone so much for watching this week's video. Make sure to turn on all your notifications so you don't miss the next one in the new stable series. Please like and subscribe as it really does help me out and I hope to see you in the next one.